But but a little bit to their defense, I've talked to a couple program directors when I had a syndicated radio show around this whole thing, and a couple of them were like, you know, your show is so cool because you're doing interviews with artists and whatnot, but honestly, I, I can't play Walter Trout even if it's on 7 o'clock Sunday morning. I need to play another Led Zeppelin track. Mm-hmm. And you know what, see, Frank? I don't, I don't want to move my family. That was their excuse, literally. I don't want to move my see, family. I, Sad, isn't l- it? L- no, let but me tell true. you. Anyway, go. It's it's only true because that's the box they've put themselves in. I'm with you. When my first record was released in America in 1998, I had a hit with a song called Got a Broken Heart Mm -hmm. in St. Louis, Casey, which is a big rock station. I became their most requested artist. They got more calls requesting that song. They had me come play at their 30th anniversary birthday party with Leonard Skinner and Peter Frampton Mm. in the Riverport Amphitheater to 14,000 people. They got behind me and pushed a gig, my first actual St. Louis gig. It's Mississippi Nights. We sold it out. They broadcast it on the radio. They said to me, now when you have this hit, other rock stations will start picking up on it. And right around that time, they got bought by Clear Channel. Mm -hmm. And Clear Channel said, you're not allowed to play that guy. Mm -hmm. I had a hit already in the town. See, all they do is they cut their own balls off by doing that. And they got some guy in Minnesota programming 14 cities. It, It wasn't like that before. And new artists didn't have so much of a problem getting through. And I know that if I would have had a million dollars and could have gone to that programmer in Minnesota and stuffed some money up his rear end, all of a sudden I'd have gotten played anyway because they do that, you know. They'll still do that. And so it's they put themselves in that corner. The reason they can't play Walter Trout is not that the music isn't good. It's because they have to they have to bow down to the corporate gods who are running things who have no vision have no idea of of anything other than kim kardashian gets hits on her website it doesn't matter if she can sing it doesn't matter if her song sounds like a dog breaking wind it's kim <laughs> kardashian so they they just 